I'm a big fan of Bista Village. So many beautiful shops, all in one place. I love the whole aesthetic. That is the orange, which is lovely. I think that's my favourite. I could spend hours in Bamford. I absolutely love yeah. it. Body care, skincare, and a few bits for the home as well. Your cash rate, I think. It's lovely. First up, couldn't resist a little try on in Victoria Beckham and found this beautiful red dress. I think it's absolutely stunning. I do love a floaty white dress and this one didn't disappoint at all. It's got a lovely leather detail to the straps around the arm the fit across the chest and the waist is perfect. I love the colour, but I think it's perhaps just a bit too big, a bit too bulky. This is one of my favourite designer brands, Zadig and Voltaire. I pretty much fell in love with everything in the store. Do you cook on that or do you like those? For bedazzlers. They are, but I quite like them, yeah. Got the chick kind of way. <laughs> might try those one. That's really good. I'm different actually, I like the two zips here. love these boots. A few stud details and a bit of a cowboy look, but they still feel quite laid back. In fact, I love this entire outfit. The fit on the blazer is so good. And I love that touch boho rock chick with the hat and the boots together. Only one left, and it's half price in the sale, down to two seven five and five something. Vista's got so many gorgeous designers. You're really spoiled for choice. I've got a couple of Anyheim Marsh purses. Quality has always been amazing. They are so beautifully subtle. The leather is so gorgeous. Which one though? Now you're bringing some more. Oh, this one. It's quite cool and the leather is beautiful. I love all the pops of colour and her quirky sense of style. One of my favourite collections for leather goods. I'm pretty excited to find my favourite trainer brand at Vista. It'd be rude not to pop in. They even do mini me's for very lucky children. Two friends set up the Parisian brand Bash, and it's one of my absolute favourites. I am in love with this dress. Totally, totally my cup of tea. I feel like I've just stepped out of Studio 54. A little bit of boobage, but we can live with that. I love the whole aesthetic, the slightly 70s feel, the floaty maxis, and that classic Parisian style shining through. Do 
two beautiful maxi dresses. The first a bit 70s, a bit Bianca Jagger, and the second has a bit more of a bohemian spirit, which I equally love. Beautiful floral print with a slight sheen to the fabric that kind of glistens in the light. Then I found this pretty pink blouse with lovely detailing across the chest and really interesting cut on the sleeves. I love the colour. And then a lovely sweater for spring with this really interesting bottom detail all the way down the back. Made from cotton, so not irritating at all, and a really nice texture to the knit. And then I found this gorgeous emerald green blouse. <laughs> With lovely detailing around the cuffs and the neck. I like the smocking too on the other part of the chest. It just gives it a bit more detail. I've had a bit of a love affair with Max Mara coats since my early 20s. Travelling around Rome and trying to buy one, my credit card wouldn't work. I remember calling the bank and begging them to let it go through because I loved this coat so much. I think this cream version was my favourite. I absolutely love it. The iconic style has been reimagined over the years, but one thing that always remains the same is that impeccable quality. You can't go wrong with a classic Max Mara trench, especially for this spring summer 19. I think if it's within your budget, a Max Mara coat would make a beautiful addition to your capsule wardrobe. It's nice to see Sophie Hume, an independent designer, with a pop-up at Vista Village. I think she's there for a couple more months. I'd highly recommend popping in and taking a look at her collection. The quality is stunning. If you like this video it would be lovely if you could give us a thumbs up or subscribe if you don't already. I am supposed to say that on these videos and I always forget. And don't forget to find us over on Instagram at Fashion and Style Edit. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.